Assalamu alaikum and welcome to all. In this video, we will discuss about symmetry which provides a means of grouping or organizing the animal phyla within the animal kingdom. Let's begin. The overall shape of the animal body is termed as symmetry. Or we can say that the arrangement of body parts in a balanced geometrical design in such a manner that body is divisible into two equal halves and these halves should be mirror images of each other. That is the compulsory thing. On the basis of presence of symmetry, animals can be categorized as asymmetrical animals and symmetrical animals. Animals which possess irregular body shape and have no plane of symmetry are termed as asymmetrical animals. They include sponges that, that belongs to phylum Porifera. As in the image here, you can observe that sponges have no definite shape, they are irregular in structure. Thus, they are asymmetrical animals. Symmetrical animals are further classified into two branches, radially symmetrical animals and bilaterally symmetrical animals. Radial symmetry is the arrangement of similar parts around central body axis, that is one main axis, and the organisms can be divided into two identical halves by any plane passing through the main axis to achieve the mirror images. And the animals possessing radial symmetry are termed as radially symmetrical animals. They include the members of phylum Sedentrata and phylum Echinodermata. Let's take the example of sawfish, which is the member of phylum Echinodermata. In the first image, we can observe that it has a proper body shape, and the central part from which its arms are arising is its main axis. If we cut its body from any plane that passes through this main axis, it will result in the formation of two equal halves, as shown in the image 2. Starfish has been divided from a different plane that passes through the main axis and we can observe that it results in the formation of two identical halves that are mirror images of each other. Thus, starfish possess radial symmetry. Bilateral symmetry is the arrangement of body parts in such a way that the body can be divided into two equal halves only from one plane, that is, the mid dorsal line passing through the main axis. And the animals possessing bilateral symmetry are said to be bilaterally symmetrical animals. It includes phylum Plethihelminthes, Nematelminthes, Annelida, Mollusca, Arthropoda, and phylum. For data. To understand bilateral symmetry, let's take the example of gold, which is a member of phylum for data. In the first image, we can observe that it has a definite shape. If we cut its body from mid torso line passing through the main axis, it will result in the formation of two equal halves, as shown in the second image. One side of the body is the mirror image of the other side. But if we divide it from any other plane, it will yield two unequal halves as shown in the second image. It means that it is a bilaterally symmetrical animal which can only be divided from one plane to achieve mirror images. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching. The next video is about sea loan and will be uploaded soon. For notification, subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon. Stay connected. Allah Hafiz.